Hey guys, what's going on? It's Nathan. Just want to say good evening, everyone, both these West Coast. If you guys enjoyed your day today here on Friday, if you guys are also looking forward to the weekend coming up. And for this video tonight, of what I want to tell you about is James Apiva joins General Hospital and James Apiva on his General Hospital gig. So let's go right into it. The two links will be in the description below. Both sites are, uh, both sources are from uh, soapoutwardigest.com, posted on the 6th of June. Uh, the 6th of June of 2017, posted actually a couple weeks ago on Tuesday, and the other one has been posted on the, the 23rd, which is today here on Friday. And uh, says, the first one, the 6th of June, James Apiva, ex-Max of One Night to Live, is joining General Hospital. As a producer, Frank Valentini revealed on social media and video featuring the actor. No details about his role on the first air date were disclosed. Check out the video here by Soap Opera Digest, which I did click on, and basically Frank Valti is walking through uh, the hospital set, a general hospital, and he said, just when we thought it was safe to come back to, to the hospital, and then the camera turns and we see James Apiva in glasses, you know, reading a script. And so I, when I first saw that, I was very excited. I couldn't really believe it. And I know that, you know, there were plenty of people who were just like, really, why are we having... James Apiva on Joe Hospital. I mean, we don't need any more, like, actors or more characters. Uh, but I said to myself, and that's what I said to myself at first, too. But I, my shock was not when it was gone. I said the same thing myself, but I stopped said to myself, you know, maybe it's going to be for uh, a core character that's going to be played. Or so we're connected to a core family of Joe Hospital history. And then the next one we have is James Apiva on Joe Hospital gig. The one posted today here on Friday it says, James Apiva, ex Max of Would Like to Live, will soon be making his Joe Hospital debut a mystery role. But this is not actually his first appearance on the show. Quote, In 1984, I played a weird try to seduce Ever Since Holly, the actor notes. Quote, Someone posted it online and went, Oh my goodness, I had forgotten about that. It looked like I'm 12. His comeback was in motion when he read Joe Hospital as a producer, as a producer Craig Valentini at the daytime Emmys in April. Quote, would you ever, he said, would you ever think about doing Joe Hospital? I said, yes. And a week or two later, I got the call. He received a warm welcome when he reported for duty at the Joe Hospital set. Quote, it was great to see some old, it was great to see old friends, he enthuses. Quote, uh, Wally Kerf, Ned, came by and chatted for a while in the room. And Ronald really Hughes, Anna, who I met in acting group in L.A. in 1990, was very gracious, and now it's my presence to people. Frank was saying, have you met uh, Maurice Bernard, Sonny, as Maurice and I are giving each other a hug. Yeah, we've met. We did a appearance together 30 years ago when he was on All My Children as Nico. For more of the actor, check out the new issue of Silver Digest on sale now by Silver Digest, which is today. So if, that, if you guys have not gotten Silver Digest, please check it out. I think you'll like it. But overall... Um, I'm just looking forward to see who's going to play. I think that, and I hope that, with my fingers crossed, I hope that he is going to play uh, Liz Webber's father, Jeff Webber, uh, you know, uh, the uh, father of Elizabeth Webber, because for many years, Joe Hospital, we do know that when Liz Karen Tarot, her parents basically sent her to live with her grandmother, Audrey Hardy, but there really was no... Um, <clears throat> You know, there, there really was no explanation that they gave given about why her parents were not there for her when she was going through a lot of things that time. And I do think that if he is going to play Jeff Weber, he's going to come back to seeing Elizabeth with Franco. And he will, will be very concerned that her da his daughter is hooking up with uh, Franco. And I do hope that Elizabeth does at least hear him out and to explain himself of what he's been doing for his entire life and how he feels about Franco being the love of Elizabeth, of Elizabeth's life. So I think that will provide some juicy drama and what is uh, what may happen. And, you know, I think that, you know, it would be awkward for Jeff and Franco to meet at first, but I don't think Jeff would immediately like having Franco around uh, Elizabeth and his, you know, grandchildren. Uh, but I'm definitely looking forward to it. I'm glad that Mr. DePeva is back. I'm glad that his wife... Cassie DePeva, who is going, who is playing, um, who played Blair on to Live, and is, will cur and will play um, Eve on uh, Days of Lives in the fall, will be making a return as well. Who's also uh, healthy and happy as well herself too. Um, 
So uh, tell me in the comments, guys, about this. Do you like it? Do you not like it? Are you willing to about Jesus Power Journals during the hospital and more on the hospital gig? And so tell me in the comments down below. Don't forget to like this video. Don't forget always to comment channel, guys. And also excited as they said, peace. Take care. I will see you guys there. For, thanks for coming up uh, tomorrow morning or a couple minutes. So stay tuned. So I was excited. Take care, guys. I'll see you guys later. Peace. Have a good have a good Friday night. We'll see you guys later. Bye.